there are a few things to keep in mind when you're choosing uh, a field name. First of all, you need to make sure that you keep it and as short and as simple as you can. You're allowed up to 64 characters for your field name, but really you don't want to even have a field name that large. You want to stick with what's simple. So if you have a first name column, then name it first name, not first name of work contact. Um, also, you're going to capitalize um, like this. And notice that I don't have any spaces in between my words. You're not allowed to have any spaces. Um, and capitalizing your words kind of keeps it where you don't need spaces. It's still easy to read. Um, you can do underscores. If you do underscores, instead of having it together like this, that's fine. Just make sure that you're consistent in using that. Um, or if you don't want to have an underscore, make sure that you're consistent in using that. Also, don't repeat any field names. That's just going to, you know, keep with the confusion. And don't ever say name is a field name. You need to be more specific. Is it the product name? Is it the first name? Is it the last name? Is it, you know, whatever. Be specific what type of name it is, and that will just save you some confusion when you're in entering um, data into your table.